they've a furling and a half to go and it's Andreas Vesalius produced by Shane Cross to tackle Celtic Times and Kevin Manning dropping back on the rail is Swift one Masetto is beginning to come home very purposefully on the outside and it is Masetto and Gavin Ryan who have swept up to Celtic Times these two stride for stride going to the line Masetto on the near side has touched off Celtic Times they've a furling and a half to go and it's Andreas Vesalius produced by Shane Cross to tackle Celtic Times and Kevin Manning dropping back on the rail is Swift one Masetto is beginning to come home very purposefully on the outside and it is Masetto and Gavin Ryan who have swept up to Celtic Times these two stride for stride going to the line Masetto on the near side has touched off Celtic Times back in third was Butterfly Island On the outside is the Peckham Pouncer with the Cola Kit and Screen Siren. D Sprinter Zago Surprise. Alajaz has dropped away. No sign of Pretty Smart up the hill. And Gordon Bennett hits the front for Nathan Cross. The Peckham Pouncer and Don O'Connor on the outside of Zago Surprise, who's running on for Sam Ewing. But at the finish, Gordon Bennett wins from the Peckham Pouncer and Zago Surprise, just third. On the outside is the Peckham Pouncer with the Cola Kit and Screen Siren. D Sprinter Zago Surprise. Alajaz has dropped away. No sign of Pretty Smart up the hill and Gordon Bennett hits the front for Nathan Cross. The Peckham Pouncer and Don O'Connor on the outside of Zago Surprise who's running on for Sam Ewing. But at the finish, Gordon Bennett wins from the Peckham Pouncer and Zago Surprise just third. Little over two furlongs to go, spread right across the track, and it is Ivy Bat with the nose band coming to the front, followed by Glow Wadham on the outside with Silver Service trying to stay on. Independent Missy, Miss Molly T, bought in the dark weekends, then call for K, dropping right out as finest, and then Silver Spear. Ivy Bat is in the lead. In the center is Independent Missy with Miss Molly T battling on well in between them. Silver Service and Glow Wadham come next, and it's Independent Missy who's come to take them from Miss Molly T. And Silver Service. Little over two furlongs to go, spread right across the track, and it is Ivy Bat with the nose band coming to the front, followed by Glow Wadham on the outside with Silver Service trying to stay on. Independent Missy, Miss Molly T, bought in the dark weekends, then call for K, dropping right out as finest, and then Silver Spear. Ivy Bat is in the lead. In the center is Independent Missy with Miss Molly T battling on well in between them. Silver Service and Glow Wadham come next, and it's Independent Missy who's come to take them from Miss Molly T. And Silver Service. Coming past the halfway stage, and Eros and Psyche over on the far side in the disputing first position with Sister Rosetta and making ground in between them as Lipper Zanner, Logo Hunter joins in Measure of Magic is on the outside as they hit the furlong pole and it's Logo Hunter who's driven on from Measure of Magic challenging on the outside of Lipper Zanner and these three fight it out it's Logo Hunter and Measure of Magic Measure of Magic and Logo Hunter and Measure of Magic makes a winning return and the committed as they hit the furlong pole and it's Logo Hunter who's driven on from Measure of Magic challenging on the outside of Lipizzaner and these three fight it out. It's Logo Hunter and Measure of Magic. Measure of Magic and Logo Hunter and Measure of Magic makes a winning return and the committed has wore down Logo Hunter and Lipizzaner in third. Inside the two, and it's still in front, Rocky Sky. From Create Belief, Flirting Bridge, April Shars, Lovely Esteem, French Fusion, Vier de Verto Weekends, then Dadok Jazz, Sacred Rhyme, and Thinking of You is next, but it's Rocky Sky and Gary Halpin keeping up this relentless clip up towards the finish. It is Rocky Sky who is running away with the listed sensible stakes for Gary Halpin and Ross O'Sullivan. Inside the two, and it's still in front, Rocky Sky. From Create Belief, Flirting Bridge, April Shars, Lovely Esteem, French Fusion, Via de Verto Weekends, then Dad of Jazz, Sacred Rhyme, and Thinking of You is next, but it's Rocky Sky and Gary Halpin keeping up this relentless clip up towards the finish. It is Rocky Sky who is running away with the listed sensible stakes for Gary Halpin and Ross O'Sullivan, second French Fusion, Sacred Rhyme, third, and Lovely Esteem, fourth.
Master of Reality from Bad and Sandy. Santiago is struggling to go with them. And then Emperor of the Sun and Stratum racing to the final furlong in the vintage crop stakes. And Bad and Sandy on the outside has got to the front from Master of Reality. Emperor of the Sun is trying to come back at them. It's Bad and Sandy just in front. Leads by fine margins going to the line. Bad and Sandy six in a row. Master of Reality from Bad and Sandy. Santiago is struggling to go with them. And then Emperor of the Sun and Stratum racing to the final furlong in the vintage crop stakes. And Bad and Sandy on the outside has got to the front from Master of Reality. Emperor of the Sun is trying to come back at them. It's Bad and Sandy just in front. Leads by fine margins going to the line. Bad and Sandy six in a row. Wins the vintage crop for Dylan Brown McMonagall. Master of Reality, Emperor of the Sun, Santiago and Stratum. Coming past the two, Efrenok Fizz trying to fight off all challenges. Winston Wolf, Rockbreaker, Pempe on the outside, then Mellifera's Scott Lang, Lady Daly has dropped away, and then Excelsis and Buckman Tavern. Inside the last furlong, and it's Pempe on the near side, grinding it out in front of Winston Wolf, Scott Lang, and then Efrenok Fizz and Excelsis, but going to the line, it will be a win for Pempe, beating Winston Wolf and Scott Lang. Coming past the two, Efrenok Fizz trying to fight off all challenges. Winston Wolf, Rockbreaker, Pempe on the outside, then Mellifera's Scott Lang, Lady Daly has dropped away, and then Excelsis and Buckman Tavern. Inside the last furlong, and it's Pempe on the near side, grinding it out in front of Winston Wolf, Scott Lang, and then Efrenok Fizz and Excelsis, but going to the line, it will be a win for Pempe, beating Winston Wolf and Scott Lang. Lucis Naturea, Purdy's gift, Baltic Song, shared the honour out wide. White Desert is staying on to good effect as Hookhead is driven to the front from Cape Islay. White Desert, Delore Yates from last is picking up late in the day. Up the hill towards the finish, it's Hookhead from White Desert. Delore Yates shared the honour and then Cape Islay, but going to the line, it's a determined Hookhead who sees off. White Desert, Delore Yates, Custer's mistake up for fourth. Lucis Naturea, Purdy's gift, Baltic Song, shared the honour out wide. White Desert is staying on to good effect as Hookhead is driven to the front from Cape Islay. White Desert, Delore Yates from last is picking up late in the day. Up the hill towards the finish, it's Hookhead from White Desert. Delore Yates shared the honour and then Cape Islay, but going to the line, it's a determined Hookhead who sees off. White Desert, Delore Yates, Custer's mistake up for fourth.